I know this is a lot to take in. Just take a few days, spend some time with your family, and go over your treatment options. It's gonna be as difficult for them as it is for you, but you have to decide if you're gonna fight this thing. What's wrong with you, man? Does it still hurt? Yeah, a little bit. Oh, poor baby. Anything else on your mind? Oh. No, just, just work stuff. Shop and get some work done. That's fine by you. Okay. Is that cool? Mm -hmm. yeah. Remember the doctor appointment. Did you forget? No, I forget. We get to find out what we got swimming around in here tomorrow. Yes, indeed. Shit's getting real. Hey, big herb. Yo, Marcus. So I said, anybody that thinks a man has gotten to where he is in life based off luck is a fool. Yeah, but it does seem like some got better luck than others though, right? Nah, bro. It's about giving short shrift, making hard work seem useless, you know what I'm saying? Is it luck you never died in a car crash? I think it's a bit of both, honestly. Man, you're a good driver. You care about your wife, you care about the people around you, so you drive safe every day. But there's a million other cars on the road and you can't control them, bro. All you can do is control your car and make adjustments accordingly, so you make it home safe every day. It's luck you avoid crashing into the dude who isn't paying attention or fucking being reckless. 
the guy who gets laid off his job and goes to the bar to drown his sorrows and realize he needs to make it home to dinner, so he speeds home drunk as hell. Let's say you make it to the intersection 20 seconds before he does, and you see him T-bone a car full speed in your rearview mirror. You think to yourself, damn, I just got lucky. See? So you are saying it's luck. <laughs> I'm saying it's a good-ass cup of coffee. Thanks, man. You want some, uh, some milk or anything? Nah, man, you know me. I like it black. black. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, man, but what I'm saying is, luck can present itself, but you gotta be smart and working hard to take advantage of it. Without hard work, there is no luck. Yeah, bro, check this out. Wow. You still got this, huh? Yeah, man, what has it been, like, 10 years? At least, bro. Yo, I played Let's Bill tonight at the club and the whole place turned up. I should have kept going, huh? Yeah, man, you had it, dog. It's not like you to take off from work. You got something you want to tell me? No, Mom, I just, just wanted to stop by and see you, you know? <laughs> what about that black eye? Say nothing. Coffee bean jump at you at work. <sighs> OK. How's Tasha? And my grandbaby. Good. Doing well. So everything's good. Everything's fine. Yeah, yeah. Everything's fine, Mom. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay. You want a coke? No. <clears throat> well, did I tell you? Your grandpa was going in for surgery. I keep trying to tell him, you can't keep drinking beer and expect to flush out your liver.
What's up? Who we got next? Yo, who wrote this? What do you mean? This. Melville, who wrote this? Huh. Go through back there. Right there. Shit. Yo, you sneaky motherfucker, <laughs> man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So what kind of beat you want? Man, some bluesy, you know? Okay. You know, okay. they're dirty as well. You got it for me? Yeah, definitely. All right. Good to be here. Yo, good to see you, man. But next to the stage, we've got the innovative, creative, one of the most talented artists to come out of Texas. This is my homeboy. I ain't seen him touch a stage in like five years. Make some noise for Marcus Melville! <laughs> Wise man told me being present is a present. But when your days begin to feel like seconds and the secret sickness manifests into depression, there's no answer. You witnessing the evolution of a man who fought with his hands but fighting cancer. See where I'm from, niggas die from making drug sales. But I'm dying cause of disease attacking my blood cells. So if this my last song, I give my soul to it. With salt when shit get rough, you gotta roll through it. Heart of a king, DNA of a rebel slave. Chapters of my life with blood stains left on every page. Courtesy of that po' boy from Fort Worth With a rap dream as my net worth Conversating with experts who tell me with some chemo And a little bit of hope <laughs> That morphine will have you gone like a fiend shooting dope Man, there's so much on my mind I could barely cope Ain't even tell my folk Cause when they see me I shine And where I'm from the only stars live in telescopes Keep these lines inside like an envelope But I'd rather die grandiose Than trapped in by this cancer Paint my life, picture my wife on this canvas. Beautiful queen, and she four months pregnant. If I make it to see the birth of my son, it's a blessing. Woo! Imagine a child born with his papa left out, but stage three is one step from being checked out. All I wanted was to play ball with my little seed and look into his eyes and see a little me. Latasha, we've been together since high school. And if you left me, ain't no telling what I might do. No secrets was I promised and I apologize. Keeping the fact I was dying hidden so deep inside. But my pride won't let me fold. Even when the claws of death won't let me go. I say my pride won't let me fold. Even when the claws of death won't let me go. So when I die and God truly hit the lights, just know I gave it all and fought to the death in this life. So fuck cancer. Fuck cancer. Fuck cancer. Fuck cancer. Well, it isn't a 
cry So sit back and let me thank you Oh Lord, just let me thank you 